Okay, you guys, we got our first order. We're headed in. Let's go. All right, you guys, we're going in for Kate. Hi. Hello. Order for Kate. All right, let's leave this at the door. This is a richy rich house, you guys. So gorgeous. There, so they can open their door, step back, take our picture. And now we're going in for our second order. Let's a keep it this day going, you guys. It's 11.52. Let's go. Hey, guys, I know you can hear that wind. It's too cold for smoothies. Come on, now. Wait until next week when it's nice and 79. Hi, I have an Uber. All right, we're going for apartment. 35. Um, would it be on the bottom floor? 31, 32. Thirty eight, thirty seven. Okay. Thirty six. 30. Wait, we're looking for 35. Alrighty. Take our picture. Alright, you guys. We just got off the phone with my daughter, Tatiana. And she told me that uh, my grandson got a boot on his foot. He's got to wear it for six months. This is going to be fun. He's learning how to crawl, you guys. Anyway, we're going in to get this double order. I hope this fan does not hit my car. Yeah, you saw that. He had to straighten up. Where he's ta oh, he's taking another part. Whatever. Anyway, we're going in for this order. All right. We're going in for JJ, Jennifer, and John. Hi. How are you today? Okay, darling. Nice to see you. I see him every day, you guys. Uh-oh. Is this one of ours? Nope. Right. We are looking for the elevator. Elevator. All right. We're going to floor three. We hit four by accident. Sorry to whoever else gets in the elevator. Hi. Hi, are you Chipotle? Yes. Excellent. How are you today? Doing well, how are you? That's good. I'm doing great. Good to hear. All right, sweetie. You Thank have you a so wonderful much. day. You too. All right. Get in this elevator before it closes us up. Oh my God, you guys. The second drop off is the freaking hospital. How do I get myself into this mess? Let's go drop this off. I did text her and tell her we were a few minutes away to be outside. There is no parking. I did say please, so it, it was polite. But we need her to be outside because we got an Uber that uh, we need to be on our way to go get, so this needs to be quick. All right, let's go make that to drop off. Okay, you guys, that was quick. She was outside, and we are on our way for Robert's order. Hi. I like your hair. Let me get that for you, sweetie. matches yours. I know. That's why I like it. <laughs> are you going in? No, no. She left the jacket. Okay. Have a nice day. Like Kim says, kindness is always free. Look for Robert. Right there. 
All right, we just made that drop off. It was a hand to customer. Here's our total. And when we were on the phone with Josh, I he can't stand from the 12 hours of being bent over working on my car. And I feel so freaking bad. And I was just like, well, I needed my car fixed because I need to tell you something. The rent did not get paid. I know I have covered it every month like it was nothing, but this month was something. And I needed help that I didn't get. But um, he helped me with my car. So I don't know, my heart's too big. I feel like I feel like shit for being mad, but I can't keep paying all the paying everything on my own if I've got somebody else living with me. If, if I'm paying it all on my own, I need to be by myself. I mean, I started off the day with four dollars. How am I supposed to pay rent with that? Four dollars. I don't even know where I'm going. I'm lost, you guys. I ended up down here in Salem. I'm lost. I need to stop the video so I can pull up directions. I mean, please, someone tell me, am I a bitch for still wanting him out of the house? Because I cannot, I cannot keep paying for somebody that is not my child. I'm not dating. He fixed my car, but I mean, I don't know why I feel like shit that I need him out. We just pulled up for our next order. It is 2.03, the day is dragging. Let's go. Names that make me think of other people. I miss you, Auntie Paula, I miss you. Hi. Okay, you guys, it's 2.43 and we're finally going for our next order. I'm trying to keep the vibes up, trying to keep the vibes up. You guys send it my way. Subliminal messaging will work. Come on, I need it. I need it. All right, let's go to Starbucks. All right, you guys, we're going in for Elijah. All right, guys, we're here for our drop off. Another sea green door. <laughs> Gonna leave it on these waters so it doesn't touch the ground. Stand back, get our picture. As we pulled into the hot spot, we got another Starbucks order. Let's go. All right, now we're going in for Donna. Hi. Order for Donna. Yes. Oh my God, you guys, it's. So Freaking hospital. Let me jump off the video and call the customer and tell her we're five minutes away. I do understand that they are do doctors and nurses and they can't just leave, but you also, I mean, let's be real, you also know you ordered food. And I got lucky there was no security guard at the, ga the little guardhouse entering today because I will not put up with them being rude and telling me I can't park and I have to walk blocks away. This is supposed to be a drop off, you know, 30 seconds, but there was no guard. So we did walk in. Um, I did talk to the customer and she was like, well, they didn't have a problem dropping off earlier today. And I was like, yes, ma'am, because apparently on Saturday, you don't have a guard in your guard house. But I talked to uh, some big wig in the hospital and they told me that yes, you cannot park on their property anymore You can park a block away. So we dropped it off in the window and Here's our total But yeah, I don't want to do hospital drop-offs anymore if they're gonna give me a problem About parking 30 seconds running in and leaving it in the window. That's ridiculous. I and I don't need, I mean, let me park in the parking lot. I don't have to park in the line. Let me park in the parking lot. But they don't want you to do that either. So, yeah. Let's open another order quickly, you guys. 
That person looked at me crazy because they think I'm talking to myself. It is 4.37 and we're finally getting this order. Um, the day is just dragged on. Um, yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, let's go get our order. And I'm going to be honest, you guys. <laughs> I absolutely love Roy Will Be Roy, but his comment got me fucked up. I understand that taking a roommate led me to the situation and where I'm at. But why, in 43 years, can I not find one fucking person that can, that can take care of themselves that, do, that doesn't automatically depend on me. Yes, I should have kicked him out a long time ago, but guess what? He's on the lease, you guys. I can't. I have to go through a lawyer to make this happen. I've tried every way I can think of and even politely asked him. Didn't even demand. You know, you need to get your fucking shit and get out. I said, will you please think about leaving this is not working and I'm still stuck because it is a lease but I talked to the property manager because I do pay everything I do not him I have a sit down with the lawyer to correct the situation as long as I pay the rent Monday I'm doing everything I can Yes, I put myself in this situation by thinking I could depend on somebody to take care of themselves and I could actually, you know, enjoy my life and save my own money. Excuse me for thinking that. And Roy will, will, will be Roy if I took that the wrong way. I'm sorry. But that's the fucking way I took it. Just because somebody's nice does not mean they asked for it. All right, we're here for our drop off. Okay, move it to the side so they can open their doors. Make sure it looks presentable. Take our picture. We are in drive through waiting on this Uber. I just. Yeah, we're in drive through When I came here on Thursday, they weren't, the inside was not open. I did all that waiting in line and they want me to come inside. They could just hand it to me. No, they can't, because, ooh. We did not get drop off footage because it was a wait in car. Um. He was nice. I like gingers. He had a big old thick, full red beard. Um, that's our total. Um, yeah. So we're on our way back to the hot spot. We shook it off. I hope, I hope I took the comment the wrong way. Cause I'm just, I'm so stressed out right now. But we're gonna turn this day around and try to make as much money as possible without killing my car because we just fixed it and let's just be real you guys get the good which is the pretty face the bad which are the personality mood swings I'm sorry I'm going through menopause I don't know I don't know what else to tell y'all and then the ugly the crying because I am at a point in my life where I should be able to finally breathe and I just, I haven't been able to. So yeah, I am mad at myself for thinking that I could depend on a person to be a roommate. I should know better. I should live by myself and just pay it and move on because I didn't have a problem doing that. I just have a problem with waiting for someone to pay me back all the time and not even caring whether they do so much for moving to valley view mall where i normally sit in the afternoon because 
Tina and Josh just said that a lady got stabbed in the parking lot two days ago. So I guess we're stuck here. Two days ago, right? A couple days ago. A couple days ago. I didn't say the parking lot though. I didn't say Valley Road. You guys, it is 616 and we are honestly still in Roanoke. Um, we've only taken 10 orders today. It's crazy slow and the ones that do come in are not worth it um yeah tina we weren't here yesterday what was it like yesterday the same as today slow far and few between yep and when you do get them they're what uh oh, 13 sure miles for seven dollars or no tip no trip that's what it was yesterday. I was getting 10 miles for $4, about $17, 20 some miles. Mm. It's horrible. Uh, we got to find a new place to go on Saturdays. And Fridays. I did really good last Friday, though. Like, really good. Last Friday, I did I good. Think. And Can you look at the Friday book? before that, I did amazing. Yeah, last Friday we did really well. We took 19 orders. Yesterday was like today. Which like Tuesday and Wednesday. Yeah. Yeah, got to find a new research, a new area. Okay, you guys, it's 7.10. We finally got another order. It is freaking cold in my car. <laughs> my daughter called and interrupted our video. She wanted to show me my grandson eating pancakes and French toast. I love it. He was a hospital baby for, oh my God, like nine, ten months. So he's a little behind. And he's just now learning to eat. All right, Michael, we're coming to drop off your food. Watch that so we don't trip. All right. Oop. Yep, we're supposed to be next door. I'm sorry, neighbor. All right. Try this again. Yes, ma'am, it is freezing. There you go. Thank you very much. Honey. You're welcome. Enjoy. And now we're on our way to back to Chipotle to get this DoorDash. Let's go. Oh my god, you guys, I don't know why I didn't think to bring a jacket. I have no heat in my car. I'm cold. Alright, we're going in for Clayton. Let's go make that money. Oh, it's dead. Not a single person. Well, one person at registered. Isn't this quaint and cozy and pretty? Oh, lot of stairs and little water feature. This is nice. All right. If you are still with me watching this video, I just want to say thanks for your effort and your time. I hope you enjoy my ride-alongs. I know it's been tough lately, but, you know, this is the real life of a gig worker. So, um, yeah, if you like or enjoy my content, or even if you don't, hit the like button for me. 
And uh, don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell if you want to know when I post, which is just about every single day. Let's hope for another order. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Hey guys, I look ridiculous, but I've got my hood on. I pulled my bathrobe out of my back seat that I had draped across the like blanket. Let's see if we'll take this order, please. Don't worry, I'll take the bathrobe off before I go in Tropical Smoothie. We just got this order. Uh, we're taking it, we're taking it, we're taking it. All right, we're going in for Travis. That's Ethan. That's not mine. Alright, you guys, apartment F. <laughs> Thank you. Have a lovely day. I don't know if we got the drop-off footage because we got an Uber and the guy opened the door. <laughs> so I don't know if I got all that. Here's our total. And uh, wish me luck, you guys. We're going to Buffalo Wild Wings to get this order. <laughs> all right, let's hope this is ours. No. Yep, you guessed it, someone that doesn't have their porch light on. Oh, motion activated. All right. Stand back and light it up for our picture. And then their photo. All right, we're done. All right, you guys, I don't know how much longer I can last. It's 8.39. We have been here for a long time. We don't have nearly the amount of money that we should have for being here this long. Uh, did I say it's 8.39? Hmm. Okay, you guys, I set my little light up in the passenger seat. Hopefully it doesn't bother anybody else. We'll talk real quick. It is 9.36 and we are headed home for our hour and 10 minute drive. <coughs> We just kept getting decline, decline, decline. Um, yeah, we still have tomorrow. I'm not anywhere near the goal I need to save my place to live. And that sucks. Dude, I thought about OnlyFans. <laughs> Foot fetish. I ain't had the money to get my toes done to even start the damn thing. I mean, I'd sell my ass if I wasn't on my period. No, I wouldn't. No, I wouldn't. But, I mean, damn. I'm getting desperate, you guys. <laughs> All right, so, yeah. I wish you guys made money today. It doesn't matter how, how my day went. I hope you guys made the most money in the world because somebody's got to make it somebody's got to make it so i hope your day was great tomorrow's another day to <laughs> dry everything in our power so pinky pink i'm out I am so glad I left Uber going on the ride home because we got this order. We were 5.5 miles from the restaurant, but hey, we need the money. And as you can tell, we are in drive through but $26 is worth it. This is so fucking ridiculous. All that goddamn wait time in the fucking drive through And they're like, oh... Uh, we left our inside open late today. You can come in. Yeah, because I waited all that time in line. And it's not even ready. 
we took another one. <laughs> yeah, money, money, money. And you guessed it, we're in drive through And the inside is not open, we checked. See, they know how to do it. They got their porch light on. And we texted, so they should have opened the door. Nice night. Thank you.